Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna do a comparison between these two Cuisinart soft serve ice cream makers. Okay, so the white one on the left costs anywhere between $88 and $130, and the silver one on the right costs about $144. The white one on the left is a 1.5 quart, and the silver one is a two quart. Now these ice cream makers have a lot in common. The white one is definitely more fun, but requires more cleanup. The silver one, you get the same tasting ice cream, but it's a little easier to clean up and a little easier to use. So both of these have a mixing bowl that you have to put in the freezer and freeze overnight. Now the two quart one is a little bit bigger. It does not have a hole in the bottom. This one actually has a hole in the bottom because the ice cream is gonna be mixed up here and it's gonna come out the bottom for serving. That's what makes this one so much fun, but it is a little harder to clean up. A few more things to clean up with it. So with this white one, I do have some mix-ins that, that will, I can mix in automatically with my ice cream. I got this little cone holder. It's got a simple just on-off switch. On this one, I do have three buttons for ice cream, gelato, or sorbet. It's got a countdown timer and it beeps at you to let you know when it's done. So on this one, there's the mixing. This is what's gonna do all the mixing. You're gonna put the lid on over here. We've got the mixer in there like that. That's what's gonna do the mixing. So they both take the same recipe for ice cream. I'm gonna make about a half batch with each. So you have to mix the, the milk, the heavy whipping cream, the vanilla, you have to mix all that up ahead of time. And then it's got a nice big opening here you're gonna pour it into. And then we got over this one has a nice big opening too. Okay, so let's start each one. This one's a simple on off switch. Then this one, we got automatic. We're going to press and then start. So you can see they both, this one turns the actual bucket that's frozen, where this one, the beater in the middle turns instead of the bucket. But it's the same kind of how they're making the ice cream is exactly the same. That stuff's going to go around and get frozen to the bucket, and that's what makes the ice cream. And so with the white one, I'm going to have to set a timer. It takes about 20 minutes, depending on how much you put in there. And with this one, I can set the timer and I can adjust the timer to how much ever I want. It has some defaults also. And it's going to beep at you to let you know it's done. So let's sit back, watch these make ice cream, and then let's get some ice cream. Okay, so the silver one did beep at me, but even though it beeps at you, that's just to let you know that it's done. It does keep turning because it doesn't want to stop. It'll freeze. So again, this one, um, you got to keep an eye on it. They're both could go a little bit longer. Now, when you pull this handle down, it's going to come out. Now, same with these mix-ins. There's a little gear here. Now, those, that gear does not turn until you pull the handle down. So when you open that up, mix-ins are going to come out. But if you leave it open, as you pull this down, more mix-ins will come in the ice cream as the ice cream's coming out. And I can do all three. M&Ms and chocolate chips. And then with this one, I could get a cone. I could put my cone underneath there and the mix-ins would go in the cone as I'm dispensing it. It's got a nice little holder there. And we can see inside the ice cream is, it's getting really frozen. If you leave them go too long, it'll just freeze to the sides and the machines could stop. So with this one, you're gonna hit stop. You're gonna take this off. You've gotta find a place for this paddle and then you're just gonna scoop the ice cream out of here. If you, again, if you let it sit in there too long, it will start to freeze to it. So with this one, I just gotta add my mix-ins to it like that. Okay, so let's get like a Sunday out with this. Pull the handle down, and the mix-ins are gonna come out as the ice cream comes out. That's a pretty neat feature because I've got those levers open. And then when I shut it, they stop. So the ice cream tastes uh, the same in both of them. I could have, uh, my bowls weren't frozen quite enough. You've got to let those bowls, you've got to make sure these bowls are frozen overnight and they're super cold because it, it will make it a little bit harder than this, but it is a soft serve ice cream that you do have to eat right away. Now cleanup is super simple on this one. You're gonna, you got to clean this whole bowl, but you can take this over there. You got to hand wash it and then you got to put that back in the freezer and then you got this big paddle to wash. 
Over here, you've got quite a bit more. First, you're going to open up these, these little latches here, and this top's going to come off. Okay, so then you're going to take that whole thing's going to come off. Now, if you've made a big batch, this is all going to be full of ice cream right here. So you got to be really careful. Take it over. Now, here's kind of where the messy part comes. Now, there's a hole in the bottom of this. So you have to drain it all out because if you go to lift this off, it's just going to drain out and kind of make a big mess. Okay, so if you've got any little bit left in there, you do have to open this up and drain it all out. Now, I even like to take a little bit of water just because it makes... There. Now it's rinsed out. Now I can close this. Now I can take this bowl and rinse it out. And then to take this out, you're going to have to wash this each time too. You got to take this little tray out. It comes apart very easy. There's just quite a, you know, you do have quite a few parts that you do have to clean. So again, this white one, it, it is a lot of fun, but it is more work. This one, less work, makes the same ice cream, but you got to scoop it out and add your own mix-ins. Again, I, I really just prefer this one since the ice cream is going to come out the same. But if you know if you had little kids or something, and this is pretty cool how it works, but it is a lot more work. Um, it works really well. You know, the mix-ins, you know, they kind of go all over the place a little bit, but that's not too bad. And the, the Cuisinart makes several different ice cream makers. This one's just got some controls. They make one with a little turn knob that's about half the price. It, it does the exact same thing. Just you got to keep more um, more of an eye on. It's not going to beep at you. So underneath the video, if you could give it a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it. I also have videos where I compare these to the Ninja Creamy. Um, Ninja's released a brand. They've released two new creamies this year. So I really do like the Ninja Creamy over these. They're just a lot less cleanup. This is soft serve ice cream. The Ninja Creamies is more of an ice cream flavor or more of a texture. I will put links to both of these under the show description notes. If you if you click on the link, it'll take you to Amazon. I am an Amazon affiliate. The product won't cost you anymore, but I do get a percentage of the sale. I bought these products with my own money, and that's a way of supporting my channel. So I really appreciate everybody's support. Again, if you could, please like and subscribe, and thank you so much for watching.